hi welcome back to my channel thank you so much for stopping by this is amy from with love by amy and this is our spellbinders crafty advent calendar day 16. all right so let's open up day 16 what did we get some more dies super cool all right so it looks like some words and some shadows so it says for you and the shadows there we go cool all right so what i'm going to do for the first thing is i'm going to die cut um, some tags with the frame, my Sizzix Tim Holtz Framelits dies. And I'm going to do one in red and one in white. And the white one is going to be the background. And this is actually, I have a, a use in mind for this tag. It's going to be going on my husband's Christmas gift. He really loves Christmas, so I figured why not do it up on his present. So, um, in the red piece of the, or the red tag, I cut the shadow layer of the For You um, words out. And the thought is, with this green piece, I'm going to cut the words out, and then I'm going to layer the white one and the red one, so they're going to get glued together. Here I am quickly gluing them together. And, um, all right, yeah, so quickly gluing them together. I don't even give them time to dry, really. I just put them together. And then I am going to eyeball putting in the, uh, putting the letters in there because... I do not, um, I didn't cut the shadow out of the same piece of paper, so I didn't have the shadow as a template, really, so I could have done that, I should have done that, but I did not, because I wasn't thinking, but I think it turned out pretty cool in the end, so here we go, putting all the letters in, I'm using my reverse tweezers to hold the letters, much easier than just trying to use my fingers, which you've seen me do in several other videos, because Usually I'm apparently brain dead when I'm doing most of these videos, and the things that make my life easier don't come to mind. So, all right, and because my husband truly loves Christmas, I figure it can't be a Christmas tag without some glitter. So, after I'm done putting the letters in, here comes my brain. I'm thinking, what else can I do to zhuzh it up? And there will be some glitter. All right, so putting the last letter in place. And then here we go. This glitter, it's really, really old, as you can see from the container. But I like it because it's like chunkier glitter than normal. So it's not super fine. It's like chunky. So, but I love it. It's a very old tube of glitter. I'm not even sure. It might, it might have been around when I was a kid because my mom gave me some craft supplies from when I was little. So who knows? It could be that old. All right, so I'm going to put some a line of glue on the outside edge of the car of the... Um, tag and then I made a messy messy line over there so I'm using a scraper to scrape it and make it a little more even because I don't want it to be a messy line of glitter so I'm using my tray which I usually use it for embossing powder I don't know what it's called I got it if you look closely at it the tag says archiver or there's a mark on it that says archivers so you know I've had it for a long time because archivers has been out of business for quite some time that was my favorite like craft supply store back in the day because they had everything you could imagine all right so there it is it's all glittery and then here comes the real trick taking the little stopper out of the tray and then pouring the glitter back into the tube and I'm pleased with myself I did this without making a mess because I have made a mess with it sometimes but here we go I got it all cleaned up super excited and we got the lid back on so we're safe no glitter emergencies. All right, so then I decided because it's going to go on my husband's big gift, I needed to put a piece of ribbon through there, and I found this piece of red and white ribbon, which, yes, it is a reused ribbon from something, and it will be reused again after Christmas, even if the tag is not, obviously, because it has, it'll has it have his name on it and stuff. But the ribbon will be reused because I love to save things and reuse things. All right, so here's the finished card, or the finished tag. Let me know what you think down in the comments. I really appreciate you watching, and please come back tomorrow for day 17. And here are some other videos that you may enjoy. Thank you so much for watching, and have a great day. See you soon.